Nikeva. So that is the Superior V Nikeva. The first branch coming off the bottom. Move stuff around. Right there is the azygous vein. So that's the azygous. So superior vena cava, there's the azygous, there's the heart. This is a remnant of the mammary. All right, we follow this guy up. We're seeing uh, something a little different on this one right here. That is actually the vertebral on this guy. So that's the vertebral, it's going down there. So if we follow this up, this is the brachiocephalic, brachiocephalic. We follow this over here, this is subclavian, this is jugular. There's internal, there's external, this is still external, there's a transverse scapular. We follow this over here, this is axillary, and then that is your subscapular. And then that's all we can really see over here. We follow it this way, here's your brachiocephalic, subclavian, jugular, follow subclavian, or the uh, jugular up, so this is external jugular here. This is the internal jugular. So this is the only one that it got injected on. That's internal jugular, external jugular. Over here off the external jugular, you see that transverse scapular. Follow the subclavian out. This is axillary after the branch. This is subscapular. We follow axillary to here, and now we're into brachial out here. All right, let's look at the arteries in here. So. Here's the heart here. This is a brachiocephalic. This guy right here is your subclavian. We follow the subclavian again. So what we should see is one of these guys going in right there and there is your vertebral. You can also see there's the vertebral vein on that side. We follow this here, now we're at the axillary. Okay, so axillary here. Uh, this guy that came this direction, as you can see, it's going to run parallel with that transverse scapular vein, so that's a transverse scapular artery. If we follow this out here, this is still axillary to here, then this becomes brachial and that becomes the subscapular. Follow on the other side, brachiocephalic here, we're going to have some branches, the first branch right there, this guy right here and you see it continuing this way, that is your left common carotid. So underneath here, you're seeing the other branch off the brachiocephalic, that's this one right here, that is your right brachiocephalic. We have a little blowout on the, I'm sorry, the right common carotid, that's a right common carotid, you see a little blowout there. This right here becomes your right subclavian, and so this little guy coming off there, that's your vertebral, this is axillary, follow axillary and kind of get lost out here then.